And there you can see. Ta-da! You, so you can see you uh, you see you can put whatever you want inside of these table data. Now you may say, well, what if I want this data to be aligned to the center, much like a header title is? It's actually fairly simple, and I covered this somewhat in my align slash div tutorial. But you just in Dreamweaver, the benefit of Dreamweaver is you can manually select it, so you don't have to search for it, and your cursor will automatically go up to where this element is, and you can see it automatically selects it for me here in Dreamweaver. This table data content and you can apply an align attribute align equals center and now everything inside this table data which is our text that says data for header title one will actually be aligned to the center pretty interesting pretty useful really so uh i mean hey as always just go ahead and experiment with this stuff you know tables are very very useful I usually don't make entire websites out of HTML, I need to state. Um, what I do is I make a Photoshop template or a design and then I export it into Dreamweaver and all the table data are already in place. But uh, if you want to add content inside of your, or if you want to add into the body, into the content of your website, if you want to add a, t a table inside of like maybe I don't know, something that you created inside Photoshop, like a panel or something like that. You know, tables are very, very useful. So, I don't really think there's anything else I can discuss about this. Um, I think that's actually it. Guys, my name is Graham with Tutorial Clarity. This has been a tutorial on HTML tables, uh, discussing the table header attribute, table data attribute, and table row attribute. We also threw in a border. I explained how you can have whatever HTML elements you want inside of the table data. Uh, I showed you how you can align elements within this. And uh, I think that's it. You guys, take care. Yeah.